During basketball practice, four students practice their free throw shots. The table below shows the proportion of free throws they each make. Let's see, Simone made six eighths of their free throws. David made 68 hundredths, I guess I could say, of his free throws. Elena made eight tenths of her free throws. And Raj made 72% of his free throws. Which student made the largest proportion of their free throws? So pause this video and try to figure this out on your own before we do this together. All right, so what's interesting about this is that they've given the proportion of free throws made in different formats. And my brain, and I think most people's brains, ha have an easier time doing this if we put them all in the same format. And usually, at least for me, it's easiest to put it all into a decimal format. So let's put all of these into a decimal format. So let's start with six eighths. Six eighths, well, before I even try to express it as a decimal, I can recognize that that is the same thing as three fourths. Both six and eight are divisible by two, so I'm gonna divide them both by two and I get three fourths. And three fourths, you might recognize, is the same thing as 0 0.75. David's free throw proportion is already there as a decimal. Elena's eight tenths is 0 0.8 or we could say 0 0.80 if we want to express everything in terms of hundredths. And then last but not least, Raj is 72%. That's 72 per 100. 72% is 72 over 100 or 0 0.72 or 72 hundredths. So now it's easy to compare them. It looks like David has the lowest proportion of free throws made. And then the next lowest is going to be Raj. And then the next lowest or second to highest is Simone. And then the highest proportion of free throws made looks like it is Elena. And we are done.